today we are playing with lightsabers, and we had a good time of it. We start off this one with a quick salvo back and forth. He gets just a little bit ahead of me on this one, faints to the right, cuts back to the left, lands right on my forearm. He throws a cut three to draw an attack, and I'm a little bit ahead, and I manage to give him a glancing cut across the face. Each point in, we slow down and we throw some probing strikes to try and suss out an opportunity for something a little more decisive. I push a little bit to instigate, and in the exchange, I manage to get just a hair ahead and land a nice cut two to the shoulder. I completely whiff my wrist cut and barely avoid his response, but he cuts three and I land my headshot off the inside parry. A few more probing cuts. Aaron has pretty good reach, so I try and stay outside and bait him to come in for an exchange in my measure. He comes in with a cut three, and I again exploit it with a cut six for the body. We have a high back and forth exchange here, and as he cuts high on my left, he leaves his hand high, letting me sneak in another body shot. I move in with an almost vertical cut four, and on the parry, throw a quick cut seven over the top to the forearm. bit difficult to see. My parry on this initial attack was a little low and he managed to push through it and make contact with the top of my head. It happened so fast I didn't actually realize until after the exchange. My attack to the ribs is an afterblow. Aaron slows down the pace a bit here and catches me defending, then lands a sneaky shot on my forearm. And I pay him back with another parry repulse to the body. Aaron gives an Oscar-worthy thing to my right, then whips around to my left for a really solid headshot. I try a feint of my own and mistakenly think that I landed, so I drop my guard, and he reminds me why we always keep our guard up. We cast about a bit, and I find another inside parry to cut this. Aaron secures a good line using the curve of his saber and thrusts to the face. I manage to displace it with my hanging guard and sweep it over my head to a cut one. He uses some bait strikes here to sneak into my measure, and seeing his opportunity, cuts over the top, hitting me in the face with the point. My after blow to the head is just a consolation prize. Here he gets me with my own technique, inside parry with a cut to the body. My after blow lands on the forearm, but I definitely got the worst of that one. Next he instigates my cut six, parries it with a hanging guard, and blasts through my St. George's guard to cut my neck. Outside parry to a high cut three finds his face, but it's a pretty weak hit, just a cool dueling scar at best. I thrust outside here, turning my blade out to curve the point around his parry, and just manage to find his shoulder. Aaron comes back here with his own thrust, and I parry outside, but he has some great leverage here, and I have to roll to my hanging guard. I cut one to the head, but he gets a slicing cut to my arm as well. His cut five to my leg misses by a hair, but takes him far enough offline, I can land a quick tip cut to the face. I go for my inside parry to cut six again, but I'm out of tempo and we end up trading blows. Get 
getting a little sloppy with our late fight fatigue, we have another short exchange and trade blows again. Realizing I need to liven up a bit, I take the initiative and I launch in with a cut two on the same plane as his inside guard. One more. Yeah, yeah. For our last pass, Aaron comes in with a cut at my wrist, so I fade the wrist back and let it pass by, following with a cut six to the shoulder. 